welcome back to a brand new vlogmas. Today I am heading in to um, or off to Manchester Airport. Very exciting Christmas event that they are hosting. They do it every year. I think I've been to it every year for the last three years. Having a huge wardrobe clear out. It's actually already started to go dark outside and it's only three o'clock. But yeah, Tom is having a huge, huge clear out. So we've been doing that pretty much all day today. Um, and now I've just kind of curled my hair. I've got my suitcase, mini little suitcase bag thing up there to take with me as I will actually be staying over at the airport tonight. So it's a really fun, exciting trip. We essentially get to go around World Duty Free shopping when the airport is pretty much closed to the public and we get to shop till we drop. So I am very much looking forward to that. They have Jo Malone there, so hopefully we go to the terminal which has the Jo Malone because I might stock up on a candle, we will see. Uh, so I'll obviously bring you along with me for that and then also we have a dinner tonight after that which is quite late. Stopping over at the hotel, hence why we're stopping over because it's so late and then breakfast in the morning and then I'll probably set off and come back home. So sit back, relax, I hope you enjoy and let's get on with Vlogmas week two. So I've arrived, it's oh, chucking it down. I'm just about to go in, check in, but it's always weird coming to the airport, even with a suitcase. I'm not going anywhere. Oh. Right, let's check in and get in a cozy warm room. All black today. They even have one second. Wait till this door opens. There. Where would you go? All oh, the Abu Dhabi at the top. Astana at the bottom. Where's that? Oh, Amsterdam. Level eight. Premium rooms. Eight oh four. Down here. Oh, I love this hotel. The rooms. I mean, they book us into a premium room for this event. And if I'm right, unless they've changed it this year, which nope, they're odd numbers, so even numbers. They are also facing the runway, so you get to see lots of airplanes jetting off here, there, and everywhere. But this would be the best hotel to stay in because literally you you walk to the terminal from here. Oh my god, I'm right at the end. <laughs> Do you see those goodies on the bed? <gasps> oh. Oh. oh, and this is weird because I've never been in a room with the bed facing that way. I think this is like a twin room or, not twin room, one that you can book as like a family. Oh. And we're in. So let me just show you what I mean by the view. I know you'll just be able to see a reflection there. But if you can see in the distance, these are all the airplanes. I This is like my favorite event of the year. Yeah, I think that's a room into someone else's. Um, quick room tour. So this is the bedroom when you walk in. That's what it looks like. You've got a nice seating area over there. I'm gonna get a bit of work done before we go down, seating area. Then the bathroom. Looks like so. It's pretty, pretty uh, standard Radisson themed. And um, I've also noticed on the bed, we already have a bag from Biza World Duty Free. So should we open this? Let's just plonk you guys there. Oh, this is so exciting. I love this event so much. Let's see what they've gifted us. Oh. Chocolates! Oh my god! I really wanted this perfume! <gasps> it's the replica one and it's called By the Fireside with fragrance description of burning wood and chestnut. Oh my god, if that's not me in a fragrance, I don't know what is. They also do a coffee, is it coffee morning or coffee break? Love that as well. Oh my god. Oh! so happy that we got that amazing oh a trusty fave of mine i actually just finished a pot of this um it's the clinique take the day off balm if you don't know what that is it's just like a good cleansing balm to remove your makeup and then we have some bits from dior we have an ultra dior fashion palette 
in B Bear. And then we have a Dior Addict Stella Shine trio of lip products. And then in here also we have a little plastic bag that will be for our toiletries for when we go through security. Obviously we have to have our passport on us. We have to have um, we have to have liquids under 100 mils and put in there. And then oh this is cute. Where's this from? Estella Bartlett, and it's a little like coin travel purse type thing which says on the front and so the adventure begins which is ideal for like boarding passes and passport to just slot in there and then slot in your bag i love the branding of the maison marigella is that how you pronounce it maison magiella magiella uh yeah the branding is amazing right oh my god favorite new fragrance Oh my god, does this be Jomelo Marantonka? Oh, it's a good... It's a close second, I reckon. Because I probably would only wear this winter time because of the woody fireplace. I want my house to smell of this. That is incredible. Right, I'm going to take my shoes off, chill out for a second, freshen up, get some work done. And then I'll catch you guys back downstairs when we head over to... Do some world duty free shopping. Okay, so just about to head down, I thought I'd do a quick outfit of the day slash evening. This top is H&M. It's a new favorite of mine. I have it in several colors. These leggings are top shop. They're the best invention ever. I think they're pretty much sold out over Black Friday, but I'll leave links to anything that I can that is still available below. But if in doubt, all my outfits are usually linked on my 21 Buttons account. My coach bag, my Zara blazer, this single breasted blazer is just a classic staple for me. And then these trainers are Calvin Klein Mayer trainers, I think they're called. Again, we'll try and leave them linked. And then earlier on, I just had this hoodie on again from H&M. These are the softest things and they're only $14.99. They're amazing. We've got our passes. Yay! I've just said to Irina, where are we going? Shopping. Tell me somewhere exotic. We're going shopping. <laughs> we are going shopping, which actually I'm not happy. I'm not, I am happy about. Just as much as if I was to go off somewhere like Amsterdam, which is where you just went. Yes. yes. I loved Amsterdam. Did you like it? Yes, it was amazing. Yes, it's good.
an amazing event. I will see you guys in the morning, bright and early for breakfast. And then when I get back home, I cannot wait to show you the bits I picked up. <sighs> Good morning. Just put in my jewelry. Morning from a lovely Radisson Hotel. It is around about 8.30. I'm gonna head down for breakfast now, meet a couple of other girls from last night down there for our breakfast. And uh, did I sleep well? Hmm. Hmm. I think once I got to sleep, it was fine. But I, it took me forever to get to sleep last night, which is so annoying. I'm the sort of person that is either head on the pillow, gone in 60 seconds, or recently I've noticed I've been like, not been struggling, on the odd occasion, I'll have like, I guess it's a kind of insomnia where I just take forever to get to sleep anyway. I end up getting to sleep about half one-ish in the morning, but I think it's also because we didn't finish eating until about half ten, and then by the time I got upstairs to bed and like watched TV for an hour or so, got ready for bed, it ended up being quite late and I was like on a full stomach, so... Yeah, once I got to sleep it was fine. But anyway, I'm gonna head down now, grab some breakfast, what do I need? Phone, camera, key card, let's go. Look at the absolute chaos I've come home to. <gasps> See, when you commit to a wardrobe clear out, you have to commit and not think about the mess because it's only temporary. We're actually having a bit of a wardrobe switch, aren't we? Oh, you see... I do. But I'm really bad at being ruthless with your things. I'm good at being ruthless with mine. But I'm like... With yours, I'm like, yeah, it's nice. It's nice. See, I like this colour. Is this the one you wore in Ibiza? The wedding? No, the one beneath it. The one beneath it. Oh, that one? No, it's not. It's the one beneath So you've got two... Oh, right, yeah. That one. I love that. I like that colour on you. Yeah, I like it. I like it with the navy underneath as well, actually. It's black underneath, but... Well, you know, darker colour. OMG, I have all of these bits to share with you guys in a sec. Those three parcels, I actually have this one here as well. And then all of these bits from World Duty Free. And my advent calendars. So this video is going live on the 8th of December. So I have boxes two through to eight to open up with you guys within this video. So, I'm just gonna say it now. Pause this video, go grab yourselves a nice drink, get comfy, relax, because I'm about to do a huge unboxing of a load of PR goodies and Christmassy bits that I am so excited for. My skin is very dewy. <laughs> well, look at the shine on my skin. Do I look too shiny? You're just glowing. Glowing complexion. Do you know what this is? This is the Le Mer Skin Reparative, I think it's called. It's like a tinted moisturiser as opposed to a foundation. So once we have cleared up some of this mess, I'm going to put I'm a Celebrity on and have that on in the background, catch up whilst we clear out. I'll be back with you guys in a second to show you all the goodies I got. Oh, I'm exhausted. Let me just show you briefly where I'm up to so you can understand the state of this hair and why I'm a hot sweaty mess right now. So essentially this wardrobe here, which is, or was Tom's, is now going to be mine. And that is our huge ironing pile, which I need to get on with as well this afternoon. And then through here is what was my clothing rails. So now we've switched them out. So this is pretty much Tom's room to get ready in, in the morning. Sometimes he leaves for work at like 6 a.m. So he gets ready here and this, just makes sense for him to have his wardrobe here. My concern was that all of his clothes weren't gonna fit there, so hence why he's had a huge clear out. It does look much better, and my coats don't need to be out. This is gonna be so much more practical for Tom to be able to get access to every single day, whereas coats, you know, you tend to stick with the one that you'd love the most. So that'll just be like at the front of that wardrobe for me. Dressing gowns and everything are there so I can shut that door and it'd be nice, neat and organised, like so. And then ironing poil, uh, ironing poil, I need to do today. So, and calm. Never underestimate clear out. I feel like I've done 10,000 workouts in a day. <laughs> anyway, so I showed you the bits that we got gifted in the room at uh, the airport. 
I thought I'd just show you what I actually picked up from Duty Free. So the first thing uh, I got from Victoria's Secret were some leggings. They are workout leggings. I'm going to be wearing them just around the house kind of thing. And these were £29 at Duty Free. That's my phone. Um, and I got them in a size small. Oh, I think they're in the wash, but I have another pair of Victoria's Secret pants. I couldn't remember if I got them in a small or medium, so hopefully they'll fit. Nice and high-waisted, got Victoria's Secret down the leg. And then I went to Jo Malone and spent the rest of my dollar there. So I did get quite a bit. I'm going to show you what I got. I, did. I treated myself, you know. Oh my God. It smells amazing. I picked up a candle. One of the Christmas range candles in orange bitters, which smells so fresh and quite light that I am going to actually save that probably for the new year. A nice light wintry scent that's not necessarily festive and Christmassy. And then I stocked up on another favourite of mine, the mimosa and cardamom. I like to mix this with myrrh and tonka, which is like my favourite fragrance. And this I have had in the past as well. It is their vitamin E lip balm, which is actually like a typical everyday product that I wear with a new lip liner. So I love that. So I stocked up on that. And then in the other bag here, I don't know if you can see in there. Ooh! So uh, the first thing, let's just open this one here, I went for is a hand wash. Earl Grey and Cucumber this one is in. And I have the hand uh, moisturiser in Pomegranate Noir. Now they had ran out of stock in the hand wash in Pomegranate Noir, but this was my um, favourite scent that they had in stock. Earl Grey and Cucumber, so nice and fresh. So I am going to be that person that puts aside this for maybe a future house. <laughs> for like, you know, a display bottle. And yes, once it's finished, I am going to be refilling it with cheap soap. <laughs> and then I also got in here, in fact, I got two of these. So they're just same again in another box. She like gave me loads of gift wrapping, which was very much appreciated. I went for the other candle. So we have the orange bitters Christmas candle. And then we have this one, which is so nice. I bought two of them. They, oh my God, it's so good. Pine and eucalyptus. I'm going to put one of these in our living room because with the pine centicles from the tree, I think it'll work really really well with and the Zaflora that I've been using in my kitchen is the new one that they've got the sparkling spruce so it all smells of pine down there which is lovely and then what was so nice of the ladies at Gemini because I spent that much I also got a cute little gift which included within is a mini candle. I'm trying to like rush through this because I've got a lot to show you. A little mini candle in a Jo Malone pouch and it is in peony and blush suede. So that was everything that I actually bought from Duty Free. And then whilst we were there, we had a few treatments. Went to Morton Brown, went to MAC, went to Estee Lauder. Had a spoilt session essentially and they gifted us with a load of freebies which was so kind of them firstly this bag which is from dkny it's the next to love uh, perfume freebie beach bag type thing and then estee lauder gave us a little pouch with some products in we have a take it away makeup remover lotion a revitalizing supreme we have a little palette we have a mascara like purpley kind of shades. I actually have someone in mind that might like this. So I'm going to keep this all gift wrapped up for her. Zadig and Voltaire actually gave us a shower gel in Just Rock. And then also within here was a little keychain and a tote bag as well. And then we got from Le Mer a couple of little sample products. The Concentrate in here and the Revitalizing Hydrating Serum. So thanks to Le Mer. And then Kiehl's we got gifted a little goodie box. Loads of different samples in there actually. But the ones that I wanted to particularly show you was this. Little Ultra Facial Cream. This is one of my favourite moisturisers. One that I'm currently using. So nice little travel size. An Avocado Nourishing Hydration Mask. And then also this. They have micellar cleansing water at Kiehl's, which I've never tried before. So this is the herbal infused one. So that's a good little sample travel size to take away if ever I do have like the odd night away like I did last night. And then Molten Brown. Oh my God, there's so much. Oh, there's Givenchy in here as well. They gave us a little 
perfume samples, two lot perfume samples. And then Molten Brown gave us some perfume samples. Which one's my, this one, Coastal, Cypress and Sea Fennel. That sounds amazing. They also gifted us this. Super generous of them. Inside we have a little pouch, Molten Brown travel pouch. Oh, it smells lovely. And then we have a shower gel. I actually bought this one for my dad for a Christmas present. I think it was either last year or the year before in Bushukan. I think it was last year, actually. It smells really, really good. And then also in here is like a little travel uh, recharge spritzer thing with some Molten Brown fragrance in it. I'm trying to... Oh, is that the, the same scent as that? Maybe I think it is. And also whilst I was away, I missed a couple of parcels, so I thought I would just open those up. So Hut Group very kindly sent me two packages actually. The first one includes some drumstick lollies and a Clinique Take the Day Off uh, balm, which I'll probably put to one side for a giveaway because I've already got one of those. And then also this, which is from Colour Wow, and it is a set with a shampoo, conditioner, root thickener, and a heat activated leave in treatment. Christoph Robin cleansing purifying scrub with sea salt. We have uh, something from Ico. This is a Black Magic Drama and Cal Mascara. A Grow Gorgeous, the original hair growth serum from Mio Skincare, the Future Proof Active Body Butter. And then lastly, ooh, La Masca have sent a highlighter. Let's see what this looks like. Look at that color. That's beautiful. And then in this package we have from L'Occitane, Festive Garden Ultralight Cream. Oh my God, I bet this smells amazing. Oh, it's sealed. I don't like to open products if they're not open yet until I finish the last ones. And then they also sent this multi balm, lip balm. You can use these on your cheeks as well in glittering touch. Okay, and then last but not least, we have a product from a company called Browns. This is like a jewelry brand that very kindly offered to get in touch and send me this. We have a discount code here, 15% off using the code FREYA15. Um, and then inside, <gasps> yummy, we have some Honeywell Biscuit Company biscuits. Two little packages. Oh, cute. These are little gold huggies. I love wearing little huggies, which are just simple little hoops. And these ones have, let me see if I can focus it, a slight kind of embossing on them. So they just look a little bit more glitzy without actual crystals in there. Oh, that was a loud snap. Snap? Snap. I was going to say slap. Oh, that is so pretty. I love minimal jewellery. It is a very pretty little star necklace. Perfect for the festive season. Oh, that's a nice length actually. Yeah, really nice. Amazing. I think I'm going to leave this part of the vlog. Oh, another loud slap. Snap. Am I okay? I'm tired. Oh my god, you should see the beauty clear out. I'm having you ready for this. All this stuff. I'm either gifting or, um, or donating, giving to friends and family for Christmas, putting away in giveaway piles for you guys. It's a lot. <laughs> it's a lot. First of all problems, I know, I'm so lucky, but it's nice to be able to give back to you guys and family and friends as well. We're ending the night with the most festive film, the holiday. We've got our candle lit. This is the one called Pinecone from Home Sense. Tree is on, garlic bread, salad, and Tom has made us his speciality this carbonara it's like my favorite requested by me tonight and lovingly done by you so thank you wow i'm pale <laughs> it's that time of the year where i am super pale so it is it's a new dawn it's a new day and today i have a couple of errands to run i need to nip into town center just to make a quick return i also have a charity shop drop that i need to do and just to help me with a bit of a clear out process just declutter and try and like get organized this time of year is always a little bit stressful not gonna lie so i have 
quite a few items that I want to drop off at the charity shop and last week obviously vlogmas was the first day of December so I did a shopping trip to home sense come shopping with me got a bit of Christmas decor and stuff in that video I opened up day one of my advent calendars which this week obviously we have day two through to eight to open so I'm going to open them rather than every single day because I'm not going to necessarily vlog every single day so in order to not miss any I thought I would just kind of open them within one sort of at the same time so I have all of my beauty advent calendars to open which I'm going to do in a second but I also had the postman just deliver a couple of bits I've just had a letter woo it's that time again I can't believe it's been three years since my first ever cervical screening test but I thought I would just quickly jump on and mention the fact that this is going to be my second. If you are around my age and have never booked one in or a couple of years younger than me, don't be afraid, never fear, get it booked in. I'm going to book in my second one now that I'm turning 28 in January. It is time. I think that every three years. Last time I did actually have the cervical screening test done and then my cells came back abnormal so I actually did have to go back for a secondary visit to a gyne gynecologist <laughs> gynecologist to just have him check and it was absolutely fine after that visit so nothing to worry about but all the more reason to get tested and just just check just don't put it off if you are scared it's really nothing to be scared about so I had this just arrived and I've had a quick peep in and I've seen that it's from Bobby Brown so I had to open this on camera I've also had this arrive as well so, okay so this is their Christmas 2019 launch and then there's some on the back there as well and they've very kindly sent me four items from that list we have I love the packaging of Bobbi Brown. We have a luxe eyeliner, and then this is the Soft Smolder Longwear Eye Kit. Smoky Eye Mascara with Nude Beach and Bark Sparkle Stick. I love Bobbi Brown Sparkle Sticks. They're my absolute favorite. I have a gold one, which I wear when I do my face of makeup properly. I wear it every single day. And then we have a Luxe Liquid Lip Rich Luster in Gold Star. Oh, pretty. That's actually not like gold gold. It's actually quite a nice brownie tone. Nice nudie gold. And then lastly, they included this Glossy Lip Duo. So there we have it. Thank you very much to Bobby Brown. Now let's see oh, what's in here. Ah, it's from Vera Moda. I didn't know this was coming. I have no idea what's inside here. Sparkly seasonal socks. And also this, is it a dress? Oh, there's also some makeup in there too. From Ciate, their Wonderland lipstick, a Demi Shine lipstick in Royal. Let's crack into these bad boys. Should I really just call an advent calendar a bad boy? Oh my God. So I'm gonna run through these pretty quickly, but this is the beauty expert one. In box two, we have, oh my God, I thought I could smell Espar. I love it. This is an energizing shower gel. Box three, we have from Maoli, a sleep dharma pillow mist. Again, I love using pillow mists, um, especially if you struggle to sleep. Box four, this is from Inica. This is a vegan brand. It's a bold lash vegan mascara in black. Behind door five, we have from Christoph Robin. This is their daily hair cream with sandalwood. I bet that smells amazing. Door six, we have from Philorga. This is a smoothing radiance mask. Oh, it's got hyaluronic acid in it as well. Door seven, we have from Illamas amazing we have a omg beyond powder i actually have this already i think yeah i already have this so i'm gonna keep it nice and pristine and give it to someone this year for christmas and then behind door eight deep moisture eye contour cream from madara never heard of this brand before intrigued to give it a try okay next up we have loxy tan and this is a unique one because of the way that it folds and there's door numbers on all sides so let me find doors two through to eight in two we have an almond milk concentrate in box number three we have a foaming cleansing cream we have a dry skin foot cream their hand and feet creams are always the best number five we have a 
precious cream these little eye patches like an eye mask type thing in number seven we have a an intensive hand balm for very dry skin i've never tried that one before but again if you have particularly uh dry skin then lots of 10 is a great brand and then number eight we have a little milk extra dental cleansing soap glossy box Okay, box number two, we have a, oh cool, a little perfume sample from Chloe Perfumes in Nomad. Number three, and it is a Glossy Box Beauty Blender. Box number four, oh cool, this is a Leak, <laughs> Leak, Lip and Cheek Pencil by Nude Sticks in Mystic. Box number five. Yay, from the Body Shop. It is a mango hand cream. I love Body Shop products, they smell amazing. We have a makeup brush from Luxie. Oops. Box number seven. A Wickedly Divine eyeliner. Look at that red gem on the top. And it's in this like sparkly kind of um, pinky color. Box number eight, Pro Base Primer Oil from MUA. And if you can see there, it's actually got little flecks of gold in it. Okay, look fantastic now. And let's open boxes two through to eight. Number two has inside it, oh yes, love Living Proof. This is a perfect hair day, five in one styling treatment. Ah! In door number three, we have something from Cordelie. It is the... Clear Skin Purifying Toner. Number four, we have from Luxie. Oh, again, another Luxie. Another couple of makeup brushes. <gasps> Door number five is a good one. It is the Pro Collagen Marine Cream from LMS. I love LMS skincare. Number six, we have from Illamasqua. This shade looks incredible. It's a lip pencil in the color Raw. Door number seven. <sighs> I love Rituals, and this is their dry oil for body and hair. Door number eight, yay, Philip Kingsley. This is a deep conditioning treatment. Again, I love their hair products as well. And then the last advent color I have got a bit damaged in the post, it is from Kiehl's. Oh. Okay, door number two has an ultra facial oil-free gel cream. Love that, used to have a full size one and I ran out. Door number three, we have a little mini midnight recovery concentrate. Four, we have the Rare Earth Deep Pore Cleansing Mask. Up here, we have door number five, and there is a Hydro Plumping Retexturizing Serum Concentrate. That's a bit of a mouthful. Door number six. This is a Super Multi Corrective Cream. Seven, full size product. This is the Calendula Deep Cleansing Foaming Face Wash. I love the Calendula. Um, range of products door number eight we have a clearly corrective dark spot solution and we're done for today anyway until next week and until vlogmas week three good morning the sun is shining my breath you can see it because it is cold myself and tom we're actually going on a long 13 mile walk today. Tom's actually training for a 100k walk in a day. I am not joining him. And we're walking to a local town called Skipton, which is about a 30 minute drive, four to five hour walk. So we're gonna go there. We've got Christmas markets there today. And then he's already storming ahead. We're actually meeting some here to walk the journey with and then we'll get a taxi home. <sighs> we only just started and I'm knackered. Got some sheep with us, keeping us company. Ooh. <laughs> We're not prepared with trainers. Bar am you. So pretty.
found a wolf. No. Wolf. 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 No, that's not the picture, Tommy. We were looking at yeah, this. That's the same. Look at this one. Yeah. Oh. Same, yeah. Okay, taxi to him. From a very sore, tired Freya. This is gonna have to be the end of vlog. I was gonna say 2019 then. Vlogmas week two. Honestly, my feet, my legs. So there were four couples in total doing this walk and all the girls have had pain. Oh God, I can't even stand up. On this walk, all on our hips here, here and down like our legs and honestly, oh. I'm gonna sleep well tonight. I've got I'm a Celebrity just about to start. We get straight in that bed, get cozy, get comfy, go to sleep. But I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Thumbs up if you did. Subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified when I upload next week's Vlogmas Week 3. Countdown to Christmas. Hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you guys then. Bye guys.